Okay, it is day one of Late Show Texas and headed down there right now. We are in Fort Worth and I'm excited. Let's go. <laughs> okay, this is the line outside the door. These are all the dedicated folks. So for this video, I thought it would be fun to ask some people what they're carrying, do some pocket check videos. I've seen these videos in the past and I've always really enjoyed them. So that's what we're gonna be doing today. These are the really dedicated people. These are the people that have probably been waiting here since, oh, since last night. I know a lot of people camped out here. How long did you wait in line? Uh, I waited 12 hours. 12 hours, okay. Well, we're doing a pocket check video, okay. and I, I'm curious on what you're carrying, what you're carrying to Blade Show. So. I have a uh, McGinnis Extreme Hunter. Okay. And uh, this is a prototype for uh, guthing knives. Okay, and are there any knives here that you're really looking forward to getting? Uh, JB Stout. Uh, Good and choice. Brad Blanc collab. Oh heck yeah! Okay. okay, Tito, what are you? What's your carry uh, right here? I have the Blade Stout Showcase? Tempest on me today. Oh, with that the is red a red G10 beauty. scoop. How long have you had this one? Uh, last year, Texas Blake. Okay, and who are you here to see? Everybody. Everybody. Every, Good choice. Everyone. Good choice. My name's Brett. What are you carrying? At Blade I got Show? my Mokume JRW Curator. Oh my mokume tooth from steve from into the wild these are hard to find very yeah and those then, are exclusive uh a nice little rosy just can't go wrong Good here with paula and she has a blade x a blade hq exclusive hq exclusive 940. nice nice can i hold it for a moment sure when did you get this i got it about a year ago on our honeymoon uh, carrying a tactile turn maverick and uh, micarta yeah Looks like you have something else there in your hand. What's uh, that? Yeah, yeah, some Blade Show swag. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> Go, Matt's Blade Show carry. Handing him out. So oh, great, how great. Can you say no. Free knife, right? I saw Gabriel, and we knew he had some sick styles, and he's probably got a really sweet pocket knife. Oh, Gabriel, what is this? I am carrying a Benchmade 51 Morpho. Discontinued, I believe, for several years. Can you flip it at all? Yeah, a little bit. Okay, okay, let's see it. Wow. Nice, that's perfect. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Okay, we have Josh here waiting in line. Josh, what are you carrying for Blade half Show Texas? Half-face blades today. Oh, it, half-face blades? Uh -huh. Nice. What do you use it for mostly? Uh, actually processing animals on uh, hunting trips. So yeah. you truly use your knife. Yeah. We have David from Microtech Knives. David, what are you carrying at Blade Show Texas? Got an old school Nemesis, hand rub satin, single action. Perfect little Pocket nice. carry with Truly a safety. Old school single yep. action. There we go. Do you have anything you're carrying on you right now? No, I don't. I came from Hawaii. Oh, they're they pretty strict me. there with their knife laws, I've yeah, heard. Okay. Very. Gary, what are you carrying on you? I got a Strider SMF in PD1 with the uh, Gray's Precision LBS. I just picked up my first ballad song ever yesterday at House of Blades. So are you gonna learn some tricks with it? Uh, I'm gonna try to. Okay, now we're getting outside to some more folks. Let's see if any of these guys got some cool knives that they are having in their pockets here at Blade Show Texas. Okay, this guy came right up to me. He was very enthusiastic. Ontario, uh, SK5 Blackbird. Creek store's favorite the splits. knife. What's your name? Magic Mike, baby. Magic Mike, okay. Magic Mike just sides. came right up to me and was like, I can do the splits and this is what I'm carrying. There Thank you, you Magic Mike. <laughs> You're welcome. Charles, what are you carrying with you at Blade Show, Texas? Uh, so I'm carrying a Kun Wu Padre. Where did you get this one? Uh, this one I actually ordered off Kun Wu's website. Hey, this is Asa, and Asa's got whole EDC bags set up. Look at these uh, little Pokemon patches. I want some of these. EDC mm. crowbar up in there. Oh, cool. We got Yoshi in the house. Okay. I've, honestly, this is one of the most interesting, <laughs> coolest pocket check I think I've ever seen. And he's got a fixed blade. Oh, nice. Okay, and that is a nice fixed blade there. Thank you so much for showing that to me. Yeah, it's not, it's not like sharp. Sweet. What is this? The Hogue Deca. The Hogue Deca trainer. Oh, cool. Uh, Patricia, Patricia, what are you carrying? Koenig Mini Areas. Oh, Koenig. They are, these are not easy to find. Like, they are not. Are, yeah. You had to wait in line for that one, didn't you? DLT exclusive. <laughs> oh, on nice. the drop, and I don't know how I did it. Yeah. <laughs> Andrew, Andrew, what are you carrying in your pocket? I have my Squid Industries Oh, there Kraken. we go. Oh, nice. Bowie. Good choice. Good choice. Are you going to be running to see squid right away? Yes. Okay, I like this, and this is like actually really cool. Yeah, Are these new? Yeah, they're fairly new. They're the squid bags, and yeah. they have pockets for 
Those are sweet. Okay. Well, thank you. Okay, this is Mark. Mark, what do we have on us at Blade Show Texas? I have this. I bought it in, in um, Hillsboro. Okay, this is a SRM folding knife. It looks like the line is starting to move. However, those are the early birds, and I can attack this line right here and see what they are carrying. Hey, what are you carrying on in your uh, in your pocket here? I have the last last scorpion six bensog. Nice, nice, good choice. Are you gonna? I'm sure you're gonna be checking them out today. They. Yeah, I'm gonna hang yeah, out there's... with Shane a bit. Sweet. Can I hold it? Yeah, of course. Hopefully. And where'd you get start... this one? I uh, made that. You made this. I made that. Oh man, cool. That's so, fun. So you're... I'm gonna start trying to get them out in the wild for now. Buddies just have them. You know. Heck yeah. Maybe start someday you'll be them. exhibiting in there, right? That'd be dope. Yeah. Heck yeah. Hey CJ, what do we got in our pocket? The Shiragora Gen 3 Haiti. Oh, good choice, man. You know, someone has style when they're carrying something like this. Are there any makers, companies you're looking forward to see? Uh, Vero. Vero. Uh, Vero Shiragora Protec. Yeah. Okay. Good lineup. Joshua, what are we carrying in our the, pocket? Uh, the Nafslander 2. Oh, nice choice. And who are you here to? You're going to go see NAFS, I'm NAFS sure. and then Microtech. Okay. Oh, sweet. Can I grab it? Yeah. Yeah, Microtech's here. NAFS is here. You know Ben? Meet him today. Oh, cool. Oh, you're going to meet him for yeah, the first time. Okay, he's great. Wealth of knowledge. Thank you for showing Thank that you. to me. Yep. This gentleman told me he knows somebody with a cool blade, so we're going, we're going to find him. This better be the coolest blade I see all show. No, I'm just kidding. No pressure. No pressure. <laughs> <laughs> no pressure. Man, this line is really long. Okay, this is Steve Jennings, and this is the gentleman we've sought out. Okay. A basket weave feather. Okay, it did not disappoint. Do you mind if I hold it? Go ahead. Okay, I'm really, that's really cool. That clear resin handle, and that is a beautiful feather Damascus blade. Who made this? I did. You made this? Okay, yes. this is awesome. We have a lovely couple, Sharon and Mark, and Mark has a knife that he would like to show us. It's an old Ontario. It's a classic. Okay. Yeah. How long have you had this one? Uh, about 25, 27 years. So you are a testament to the durability of Ontario knives. Absolutely. Love oh. the knife. I just, it's carbon steel, so it tends to rust. So I'm going to get another one. Another one today, huh? Yeah, I'm going to get another replacement. Okay, great. Thank you. This is Anthony. And Anthony, what are you carrying on you? Um, I'm carrying my BRS rep. It's, it's a little throw together. I just oh, put, uh, bought choice. a bunch of parts and just threw them together, so he, he does custom work Dude, on it. That is such a sick looking songs. knife. Yeah, that is a beautiful Bali. Yeah. Doing like a one second flip, you don't have to go crazy. There you go, oh, he's smooth, he's, he knows what he's doing. Okay, he's done this before. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Yep. Awesome. Dan, what are, we, what are we carrying on us? Uh, I got a custom done by me. Oh no, where is it? There it is. I got too many knives on me today. <laughs> hey, that's, that's not Here a it problem. Is. This is a Sencut Arc Blast. Oh, I did cool. the laser mark on the blade, okay. but I do custom laser marking, so I did that little bit on that handle there. Oh, that there. looks but nice super lock. clean. It all goes really well. And I've been experimenting really with well. the laser marks and didn't want to do it on something that cost too much. No, that looks sick. I asked Steve, I was like, do you have a cool knife on you? And he says, just a work knife. And I said, well, I want to see that work knife. Just, oh, a, so just a Damascus work, work knife. So this is cool because this is a knife that you actually that's every use. Day, that's everyday work knife. And I can tell that you truly use it. So no, yeah. someone, who, someone who uses their knives. Thank you, Steve. Thank you. Okay, what are we carrying on us today? This little Justin Ooh. Plunkwest Wee uh, Black Void Opus. That's a beautiful shape. It's a very different shape. Very yeah, kind of funky. Yeah, very, very pretty. Chisel grain. Okay, we found another lady. And Mandy, what are you carrying on? Uh, I have a Benchmade bug out. Oh, okay. And this awesome teal Classic. color. It's my favorite. Just use it to cut my wristband off. You know, okay, very I handy. Like the, I like the color on this. <laughs> okay, we have another Bali boy here, Archie. Archie, what Bali song do you got on you? Machine Wise Seraph. Oh, good choice. Who are you coming here to see today? Squid. Could have guessed that. I could have guessed that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're great. Thank you, too. Okay, Michael said he's got something sweet to show us. Michael, what is it? A Riot Tiger. Riot's going to be here. Have you held their new Gravity Razor Blade yet? Not the Razor. But I have the uh, XO and the XOK. That grind is sick looking on. I love that compound grind. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, appreciate it. I, I could have swore that you were going to have a knife well, on I you. I was flying, so. Oh, okay. So well, what do I got? Well, well you know, yeah, you don't need. You know what? To be I've nice. got this. is pretty sweet. These okay, are a little good. signature. This is a. Wow, oh, nice. Sharpie see? case. Oh, this is a sharpie case. Oh, okay. See, that's cool. You see, don't have to have a knife, but you're. Gonna I like be... those. That's really. Where did you get this again? This is a signature. I've never seen one of these. They before. have a full size one too. 
Hunter, what are you carrying on you? A uh, Protec. Okay, Protec, can you open it? Oh, a Protec automatic. Man, that is a whippy little blade. Are you going to be going to the Protec booth today? Maybe. <laughs> okay, yes. yes. Okay, well, you two have fun at the show. Okay. I asked him if he had a cool knife, and he says he has several. Got this one from Joseph Knives. <laughs> this is from Joseph Knives in Idaho. This guy, this is from Derby City Blades. Okay, another nice fixie. And this is a really unique one from Ostrom Ironworks. Oh, okay, yeah, unique is, is the way to describe it. Lewis, what do you have on you today? So right now I actually have my design. Woo! It's called the Holt. Oh, nice. That it's is in a... pre-order right now. Okay. You can get it at atknives.net. Sweet. I look at a cool wallet. You from like... Bellroy. How does that wallet work? Okay. So it fans out like that. Yeah. Ty Burner from Houston, oh, Texas. Ty Burner's. Yes, ma'am. He's really stoked about his knife. What is it? Um, Spider Co. Mannix. Is there anybody are, you're looking forward to seeing today? Uh, I got a bunch of friends that are Forge Fire Champions, so I'm going to go by their booth and say hello. Heck yeah. Well, enjoy your show. Thank you, ma'am. Have a great day. Okay, this Brave is Paul. Stone Knives. Okay, Paul. Paul was stoked on showing me what he's carrying. And is this one of your own knives? It is one of my own knives. Can I hold it? You can. What's the name of your company? Brimstone Knives. Brimstone Knives. That is a nice high polish and a pretty little fixed blade. Who does the engraving? Uh, Jake Newell from uh, GRS. Okay, yeah. thanks for showing that to us. Yeah. This is Kyler. Kyler has a fun, colorful knife he's carrying with him. I see some Dessert Warrior yes, in the house. Yes, okay, remix. Which, Oh man, are you going to be at the Blade HQ uh, booth I'm taking? Oh, at? absolutely. Uh, of course. Are you going to be buying some more donut inspired knives? Uh, if I could afford it. <laughs> <laughs> Steve, hey. what are you carrying on you at so, Blade Show? So, actually, myself is a knife designer. Oh. And this is a prototype with Kaiser. This is your design and with it's Kaiser. It's not out yet. But That's great. Any idea when this is going to be released? I'm not sure. I'm expecting a new prototype soon. Am I allowed to show this on camera? Of course. Okay, yeah. okay, just making sure. Some people are, don't want their prototypes getting shown. So. Oh, oh yeah. sweet. Mark, yeah. what do you have on you? This is a uh, Borka custom stitch. Oh, this is a one that, of one. One Only of one. Only one that exists in a world like this. When did you get this? I got this uh, this year from Sebastian himself from Borka. Sebastian's a pretty cool guy, huh? Yeah, he's awesome, man. Yeah, that's well, great work. Enjoy your show. Thank you. Colton is all geared out. I'm like, Colton, what are you, what are you holding on you today? I have the. Uh, this is from 2022. Okay. Uh, Blade Show Texas exclusive. Okay. Two years ago. Can I, I hold it? Carry it. Yeah. And this is a key bar from the same year. Also Blade exclusive. Actually, that is a really good looking key bar. I really like the colors on that. Yeah, that's copper. Yeah, that is cool. Solid Man. The line has started to move again, so all the attendees are being allowed into the show, which means I am going to be going in the show. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> which means I'll be heading the show to probably bother more people and ask them what they're carrying because this is very fun. <laughs> Okay, we are now entering the show. Okay, we have Benjamin from Shea Butler Knives and he has a really cool pocket check. I'm gonna zoom in. in. What do we Check have here? Oh man, a belt buckle. And you have a patent on this? Yeah. Okay, so where, where can people get this if they want to? You go to bluecollarblood.com. Bluecollarblood.com? Okay, sweet. Abby has a really cool blade on her, a custom-made Allen Fultz. I love the purple. I just, I, watch, I almost just cut myself with it. Thank you, Abby. Have a fun time at Blade Show, Texas. You too. Okay, we have Holden here, and Holden, what are we carrying at Blade I, Show, I'm Texas? I'm carrying a button barber. Oh, what is it again? A button barber. Burke Blades button barber. Oh, sweet. Oh, that's a unique looking one. Yeah, I love. I absolutely love it. How long have you had it? Uh, two weeks. Okay, well, enjoy your show. Thank you. All right, welcome. Here we have Rachel, and she has an awesome shirt that says Knife Gal. I am carrying the Civivi Elementum. Oh, I just love the black and the jade. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Yeah, have fun. Okay, I'm with Frank of Two Bastards Hammers, and he has got a pretty cool pocket check. This is from Phoenix Knives, Cowboy and Elena Siminski at Phoenix Knives. Beautiful little gauntlet. They, uh, they commission the sheath, and of course it opens for business cards or little cash and carry, the whole bit. With the choice, 
choice in gauntlets and choice in blades. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. I think I'm gonna have to do a day two pocket check video. And I think I'm gonna walk down around here and maybe get some knife maker pocket checks and turn that into another video. <laughs> um, okay, till next time guys.